Say that's the shit that fizz me up. Gentlemen, Word up. You know what I'm saying? Watching this nigga video, you know what I'm saying? They got mermaids swimming in their living rooms and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? This nigga dancing in the rain with kids climbing up mountains and shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, I'm watching this nigga video. The car going 200 miles an hour. Where the fuck is he going? Please, the nigga rapper, out the I'm here in Philly with D. Dot, aka the Mad Rapper. Got a new project coming out. You know it. Yeah, tell us about the the Mad Rapper project. What's up? You know me, Derek D. Dot Angeletti, Brooklyn style. Got that new Mad Rapper project coming. Appreciate the hate. The Mad Rapper Chronicles Part 2. Hating a little bit. I'm really angry. Kind of mad. Kind of pissed off to the highest of festivity. If you know what I'm saying. But it's hot. I got some new producers on there. You know, certified music. Mike Jers. I did a couple of joints. Got my man Scans. Got a couple of features. You know, got uh, my man Chill Moody here from Philly. Got Gunplay from MMG, Kanye West. I'll spit a couple of bars on there myself, you know what I'm saying? D. Dot Angeletti, yeah. from yeah. Brooklyn Cats, old school, you know what I'm saying? It's a nice project. Probably be dropping in two weeks. So hopefully you will get the new single coming with me and Gunplay called Nothing for the Radio. Just been working hard, baby. Getting ready to drop a couple of joints as D. Dot, the producer, you know what I'm saying? Lacing a couple of people out there with some songs. Get ready to put that crazy cat stamp back out there, you know. Okay, this this project is this uh this for free or this this iTunes digital digitally sold? It's gonna be a combination of both. I'm gonna drop a free mixtape, you know what I'm saying, which is appreciate the hate. And then I'm gonna come back with Still Mad, which is gonna have some joints from Appreciate the Hate that will like sample free if you know what I'm saying. Mm. And it's gonna have some other exclusives on there. So get ready for the for the mixtape in the next two weeks, like I said, and then the album summertime. I'm just gonna drop my my brand of heat on them. You know what I'm saying? Like, right. Um, a lot of cats are doing what they do. I just want to put my little stamp out there. Let them know I'm still here. Let them know I'm still rocking. And, and it's and it's and it's hip hop and it's pure as full. What uh what, what machine you rocking on? You using the machine? You using the Renaissance? What you what you using these days? Nah, I'm still MP3 3000. Still keyboards, you know what I'm saying? Pro Tools, you know, if it ain't broke, don't fix it for me, you know what I mean? Right. Let them engineers use all them plugins for all that extra saucy stuff that they be putting on their vocals now, you know? I'm with that, but for my foundation, I'm still basic, you know what I'm saying? Do my drums, play my keyboards, you know what I mean? And, and, and put my vocals down. Right. And let, let, let them kids do the rest with all that new technology, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> what? In, in, in your whole discography, what is your favorite beat that you've ever done? In my whole discography, what is my favorite beat that I've ever done? Yeah. Hmm. Well, I, pro I probably would have to say, I'm, I'm going to say the Benjamins, and the reason why I'm going to say the Benjamins is because I did the Benjamins on the MPC 60. And and I was really just coming to my coming into my own as a as a beat maker, so I was really trying to get my chop game up and my and my learning how to use the machine. So I kind of experimented with that beat, and it kind of came out hot. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. Yeah. Beats after that, I was a little seasoned on the drum machines. After that, you know, I graduated to the three thousand and all that. So, but that was like one of the illest beats I did when I was first learning how to make beats the way I wanted them, because I knew how to make beats already, but I was really trying to stylize them and make an impact. So right. I, I would have to say the Benjamins, yeah. Uh, outside of the Benjamins, like, my personal favorites of yours was uh, That's What's Happening. All right. And I uh, like uh, Boingo Beats. Okay, Bongo Beats. Bongo Beats. Bongo Break. Yeah. yeah. Bongo Break, yeah. That was for Busta Rhymes on the Mad Rap album. Yeah. I also yeah. like the the joint you had with uh, Raekwon and Carl Thomas. That, that, that joint was... Was was hard. Yeah, ghetto. Yeah. Yeah, ghetto was hard. Ghetto, yeah, I appreciate that. Appreciate well, and, and any any uh, future of linking back up with Ray to 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 do something? Maybe you know I saw Ray not too long ago and we talked about it. You know it's just really a timing thing. You know maybe right. for the album if possible. You know ghetto part two or something like that. You know what I mean? So yeah, yeah maybe that that might work out. Um, Eminem too. You know Buster. Everybody. You know oh, that's I'm still tight. I'm still tight with everybody. When I see him, it's all love. So it's just about time and it's just about connection. You know what I mean? Making sure it's organic. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. I know you. You were. You were doing some stuff with with Young Chris. You st you still working with, with yeah, Chris? Yeah, yeah. The Young God is working. He got some new heat coming. He signed the E1. 
Okay. Um, he got some. He got a new couple of new joints coming that I heard. He got some steam, so he's representing for Philly. Yeah, I'm still working with Young Chris. You know, Freeway out here. Like I said, the studio I'm working out of down here. I'm working out of my man Pi and his brother Josh. They call Certified Music. They got a lot of joints coming. They, you know, they producing the Lee Mason project. That's she's with Meek Mills. Um, they got a couple of joints coming, like on Glenn Lewis, and they got some new artists coming. And they also got a band. So they, them dudes are some talented dudes. And I got Mike Jers. Mike Jers is a young producer. You know, he's from Jersey. Lives here in Philly. Got a studio. So he's produced from everybody from Problem to Young Chris to Freeway to Tone Trump, um, Webby. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. he got some heat. So those are the cats I'm working with. Got um, Miss Jade coming. Miss Jade, mm. she's coming again, singing, songwriting. Um, you know, got my cousin Brayon. My cousin Brayon, shout out to Brayon. My cousin Brayon produced two number one singles for Flo Rida. So he's a musician, songwriter, producer, singer. He does it all, engineer. So got a nice little team coming for the 2013, 2014. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Yeah. Like right now, like music wise, who are you feeling like right now? It's artist wise. Yeah. I also got Wise P coming. Don't forget about Wise P. Yeah. Wise P got his new project coming. So shout out to Wise P. Shout out to Reebok. Um, I mean, I like a lot of the music, new music out there. I like cats that just make good music. I'm not necessarily feeling everybody lyrically or anybody's top ten or, you know what I'm saying. But but there are cats that's making good music. Kendrick Lamar, Wale. You know what I'm saying? Future, Drake, you know, I'm a real Drake fan. Um, I just like cats that make good records, you know. There's a lot of cats that's rapping, a lot of cats putting out novelty records. But I like, you know, and I still like the old school cats that's rapping, you know, Jay, you know. Um, uh, I like, you know, I always like Kanye. Um, I still like Common and, 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 and all them MCs, Black Thought. I still like them type of dudes too, Raekwon, you know, all them, you know. Yeah. They still rapping. I like Weezy. You know, I like I like pretty much everybody. It's just really the songs they make. I don't necessarily mess with every song, but if they come out with a hot song, I'm rocking, you know what I'm saying? Right. Rocking, yeah. It, any chance of the Hitmen getting back together to do to do an album? Most definitely. The, hit, the Hitmen have, have a bond that's like everlasting, so you could definitely see a Hitmen album coming soon. I couldn't tell you how soon, but I would definitely say 2014, without a doubt. Uh, um, collection of nice artists, you know, new songs. We got a documentary coming about the life of the Hitmen and, and, you know, the behind the scenes of all those things that happened. So <clears throat> you could definitely see the Hitmen coming soon. Shout out to all the Hitmen. You know, we'll, we'll be there, the infamous, baby. Some of the new things I'm working on right now, you know, aside from the music, I got, you know, still been doing the management and executive thing. So... You know, been dealing with Stevie J and Jocelyn from Love and Hip Hop, which is the number one show on cable TV. Um, been getting them deals. Um, shout out to Stevie, shout out to Jocelyn, shout out to Ed Woods. Because we did a partnership, you know, so we got a little company called The Good Guys. So we're doing fitness, television shows, films, um, a lot of branding stuff. Obviously still doing the music and the publishing. So you could check for that, like, on a bigger scale coming and actually it's happening, so you'll see a lot of the products coming from, like I said, from the fitness DVDs to the reality shows. So things will be coming, so you'll see a lot of announcements, a lot of internet stuff, a lot of flyers, a lot of commercials. So shout out to Love & Hip Hop, number one on cable TV right now, Stevie J, Jocelyn Edwards, and the whole squad. Okay. Tell them niggas why you mad, son. Tell them niggas why you mad, son. Tell them why you mad, son. I'm in it for the culture, you know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't be recognizing all that loop jack shit. You see, don't play that shit. You don't be a producer, you know what I'm saying? It didn't come to find out, you know what I'm saying? My brother hit me too. The nigga trying to rap, man.